Hi everyone, Michelle here and welcome to Yorkshire Budgets. So we're here today to unstuff the remaining 500 in my 1k iris binder. Um, I know I've said this a lot, so if you're a regular watcher you've all heard it. My first 500 went to my daughter towards her driving lessons. Um, I mean that doesn't cover all of the lessons. She has, she has a part-time job so she contributed towards them as well. But she got the first 500 and the second 500 was for, I've decided it was for my um, emergency fund to get to 2000, back to 2000. So we're going to unstuff it today and officially, so that's the 500 what went to my daughter, um, count it up and officially get my emergency fund back to 2k. So just going to be, you probably want to fast forward through this because I'll probably not remember to fast forward it. Um, so I'm just going to take it out and hopefully I've stuffed it properly. <laughs> I hope you're all alright. Um, the weather's awful. I'm filming this, you'll see this on a Wednesday, but I am filming it on a Monday. It's really dark, miserable, so I apologise for the lighting. Um, we're also going to do a little um, savings challenge stuffing as well today. I'd worked out my budget and I worked out what I can do, so we'll do that after that. And we're, I'm going to make one small change to something and I'll explain that afterwards. Right. This has been fun to stuff. Um, these tablets, the binders are nice to stuff. No matter where you get them from, they're all good. Right. Nearly there, but this one will be just put to one side for the time being until I decide to use it again. Right, that's that. Let me take quicker to empty it than stuff it. Right, let's separate it up into 20 centimes. If you hear any noises, that'll just be family walking about. All right, let's hope I've stuffed this properly, eh? I've got it wrong, this will be embarrassing, won't it? <laughs> There's always a possibility. Anyways, right. I think that's all tens now. I'm not very good at counting. So 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20. 330, 340, 350, 360, 370, 380, 390, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95. Yay, I stuffed it correctly. So that's a nice amount, and that gets my emergency fund back up to 2k. So let me get into my long term binder. So that's in here. So I'm going to take out the 1,500 placeholders and put my nice so that was what's shown before put in my nice 2000 placeholder to represent what's going to be in the bank okay i feel better now i feel better that's back to 2k 2k is a good start for an emergency fund well any amount's a good start for an emergency fund but 2k is good for me right next up so let's put that money to one side so i don't get mixed up with anything that's going back to the bank you know, I was using this donut savings challenge to represent a savings pot in my Monzo account uh, pot, a savings pot, and this was just savings for savings sake. However, upon reflection and doing it for a month and a bit, I realised I'm not in that place right now. I'm not in a place where I can just have savings for savings sake. I like them to have a function, a job, a title, call it what you will. So I've just got my emergency fund back to £2,000. So I'm going to transfer. Now I've got £60 in. I'll put it on screen. You'll be able to see the pot <laughs> wherever I, put, I point to it. But wherever I put it, it the £60 in there now. Don't worry, I am going to use this challenge uh, for something else. But I, I don't want to have money sat there without a purpose at the moment. I don't feel like I'm that, at that point in my journey or that point in my income either. Um, to have money just sat there without something. So I'm going to start, start on my 
it's just an emergency fund with another name, second emergency fund. So work towards my emergency fund being £4,000. Now, this is a long-term goal for me based on our income. This is a, this would be a huge amount of money. So this isn't something I'm going to finish quickly uh, within a year. I'm talking probably a couple of years. So I'm going to start on the one month ahead, which is I've had this for a while now waiting. So I'm transferring 60 to here and I'll use this challenge for something else. Um, so now um, it will have a job. Uh, let me just get this pen. I'm going to count it as starting today and transferring this. Um, so that's 14 of August 2023. It's, it's definitely not going to be this year, this £2,000 or even possibly next year, to be honest, because that my income wouldn't allow it. Um, but this would be one to work towards and then that would mean having uh, 2000 in one pot and 2000 in another account and they would be that would be a four thousand pounds emergency fund but i'll use that so every time it gets to 200 i'll put a 200 placeholder but if i put any money in i will do it like i showed you previously on the screen and you know a screenshot of my monzo pot i hope that makes sense it probably doesn't make sense because i've just blurbed on so there's 60 pounds there i'll have shown you that on screen um, so I've got the first 60 in there so now I feel like it's got a job and I might I probably will make more of an effort with it even if you slowly slowly I'll probably make more of an effort with it than the saving for saving sake so that's how that's going to be I'm not going to put place as I say until I reach each 200 pounds and then I'll do it like that and then you'll see a little screenshot of the pot on screen so hopefully within a couple of years I'll have 4,000 in my emergency but again it's a slowly slowly approach there's no rush there isn't um but it's good to have something to focus on and work towards right so that's that admin part out of the way and next up is i said i would um work out my figures and see how much i could put towards um savings challenges from my budget this month and i'd worked out i could do 40 pounds so there's 10 20 30 40 uh, this isn't my bonus cash stuff. My bonus cash coming comes from referrals, um, selling on Vinted, eBay, Marketplace, things like that. Um, and some of those apps that you can make money from. It, that's where my bonus cash stuff comes from. And I do that once a month and I try to see what I can afford out of my budget in the bank to put towards saving challenges myself. The rest of the time, savings challenges are covered by my leftover weekly money. So first up, what should it'll be my three main ones first well two main ones first so this will be my 50 envelope how much should i put in i'm gonna put ooh, can't decide i know i should have decided before i come on um i'm going to put 15 in for now so i'm gonna put 20 in there and take five out Sorry, I should have decided that before I came on. But um, I'll soon be at the condensing stage on this one, I think. I'll probably be able to do it after my um, bonus cash stuff in, which will not be while the end of August towards there. Right, that's the first one done. Oh, it's getting darker as I speak, so this is going to be really dark, this video. Right, next up is going to be my um tortoise and the hair one all right how much i have changed out some of these notes into from my bonus money into notes rather than coins how much shall i put in here right we're going to put 10 in here so this has got 20 30 40 55 57 oh that means i could condense it as well because I could mark off one of these 50s anyway I'll mark off the 10 for now and I'll do that at some point I will. has anybody been up to anything interesting been anywhere exciting or made plans for something exciting booked a holiday buying a house moving house buying a car anything like that 
Right, um, just because I'm nosy, I'm asking those questions. <laughs> Next up, I'm going to do Save the Reg one, and today is going to be a number, and it's one there, and that's worth five pounds for the one. Put five pounds in here. Let me just make that a one rather than looking like an I. There we are. Um, these are all just slow, slow build up and they'll go towards my um, variable uh, sinking funds, mainly holiday and other ones I need to start. Um, I'm still on the fence about whether to buy a different freezer and I think I probably will, but I've just not made the decision yet. But um, I'll carry on having to think about it. And the last 10 I'm going to do, I'm going to do a line at least on rock paper scissors let's have a look what do we get in for here so that's scissors which one's scissors scissors is five pound so take five out of there put ten in there so let me mark that off sorry I keep clicking I've just I should have kept it open so scissors so how much is in here now so we've got 23 in there now that's a good amount. Hopefully I'll be on the bonus cash drop and I'll be able to mark a couple more off of here. Right. Sorry, my energy is low today. <laughs> really, really low. I think it's the weather. I think it's the rain. Right, and we'll have a go and roll it up. I've marked, I've already done my first 25. I've cleared it off. So with this five pounds, let's see what I can mark off of here. So we've got two. We'll mark off two, we'll go with green this time. And that means I need, I'll put the five in, I'll take three pound coins out. So one, two, three. That's three pounds I'm taking out. Let's move those out of the way. Put in the five in. So that's got 25, 27, which is correct. So I done my first 25 and I've just marked off two. Right, and the last three pounds, I, where shall I go, where shall I go, where shall I go? I'm going to put it in my giraffe challenge. So we should we start on baby giraffe, we'll start on baby giraffe. So one, two, three pounds in there. And again, I marked off, uh, I changed this up to a £10 out of my bonus money. So we'll put £3 in there. So that's everything. Everything there should be short and sweet. Um, so if if it was confusing what I did with the donuts Monzo pot, um, all I've done is transferred it to a different challenge because I need focus and I need to, my brain at this moment in time needs to have focus on where it's going. I can't, I, I don't like having, I didn't enjoy having the money just sat there without it having a purpose. Um, so all it is, is just transferring it to another challenge, that's all. It's just the same money sat there, but it'd be a bigger goal. So I've changed the Monzo pot, you can put the goal amount. So originally I had it as 150, but now it's at 2000 pounds. So there's 60 pounds in there. That's towards my second emergency fund. And um, yeah, and my original emergency fund is back up to 2000, which I'm very happy about because um, it feels like a safe amount to have. Right, that is everything. It was really short and sweet. We've done a little bit of um, savings challenge cash stuff in. I've emptied my iris binder, which is like sort of bittersweet because you work towards it and then empty and it feels good, but then it's empty again. <laughs> it's like, oh. But anyway, it went to a good cause. I've got 500 pounds to go back to the bank and all's good in the world right i love you and leave you have a good week uh you'll see this on wednesday i'm filming it today on monday hope your weeks have been going well anyway all right and take care for now guys bye